I've decided, I've thought about it and decided by myself, majority of almost by myself with the disapproval of my uncles, some family members, some friends, you know, with, with stuff like this, you got to expect neg negativity. Yeah, you know, you got to expect disappointment. People are going to be disappointed in you. They're going to tell you that they're disappointed in you. But at the end of the day, it's your life to live. It's your mistakes to make. It's up to you whether you make the right decisions or the best decisions for what you think is going to help you succeed and grow in the future. All right, so I've decided to withdraw from Michigan State University. I did this maybe around two months ago. Yeah, so this is this is just me practically moving out. I still have a little bit of stuff in here. You know, notebook, whatever. But at the end of the school year, the people will come and the people will take all of this stuff and throw it away. It's just, I don't know, man. I don't know. Something about this transition is killing me inside. Looking back at it, like, I only had one real semester of college and decided to drop out. Not because the work was hard. The work was not hard. I just didn't apply myself 100% like I should have. Like, in high school, I graduated with a 3.8 GPA. I applied myself. I had my uncles to look after me and keep me on the right track. When I got to college, I blew all it off. I was out going to the gym, hooping, playing basketball. I went to like three parties. I was playing a game, playing 2K for five, six hours a day instead of studying, doing my homework. And it cost me, you know. Um, I probably, I don't know, it's probably, it's like a 50, 50% 50 chance that I upload this video, but this is really just for my memories and it's basically just a video for me to look back at and just be like, dang, hopefully two years from now, one year from now, I look back at it and I'm happy of the decision I made of dropping out of college. Hopefully this is the right decision for me. So I have no other choice but to work hard, grind my absolute booty off with this YouTube stuff and the social media stuff. I'm going to grind and I'm not going to fail. I cannot fail. I can't. Failure is not an option. Not right now. Not today. It never will be. I have to apply myself 100%. Like, bro, my clothes are gone. Everything is gone, mostly. I got, what, man? Y'all know I be struggling. Milk, jelly. <laughs> that's all I got, bro. But, yeah, man, I guess that's just going to be the end of this clip. I might finish it off. I might not. But if y'all seeing this, I clearly finished it off, uploaded it. And, um, yeah, man, let's get this journey started. Thank you guys for 100,000 subscribers. It means the world to me. I'm going to be here for the long run. <sighs> What's good, y'all, man? Listen, I wear these same flip-flops every single day when I, move, when I go to Cali. Now that I'm moving, I can wear my shoes again. Lovely. But now, nah, man, in all seriousness, um... Yeah, this is the real deal, bro. I got all my like my you like my toiletries in this bucket right here, man. You know the necessities. Um, some socks and drawers. I really believe that my whole all my clothes is probably gonna fit in this one little box, which is low key kind of depressing, but at the same time, it's saving me less money. This box is $126 to get shipped from here to California. That is a lot. <laughs> and I'm trying to have as little boxes as humanly possible. So I'm hoping maybe 
the maximum is three boxes. I'm not going over three boxes. It's probably actually going to be around two boxes, which is pretty good. If I just know these shoes. I won't be able to take all of these boxes. And it's, it's literally killing me inside. But you got to do what you got to do, man. Um, yeah, I still, it still hasn't hit me yet. Um, right now, T is going to our apartment to see if we can get a bigger size. Because we uh, offic initially signed up for the, the one that's 730 square feet, which is small, so one bedroom, whatever. But now she's going to try to get a two bedroom that's 1200 square feet. So fingers crossed on that. I still haven't said goodbye to my family. So I'm probably gonna do that tomorrow. And then tomorrow I'm also gonna have the boxes shipped over there. And they say it take around four, four or five to four to five days to get there, which isn't bad. So that's kind of perfect. Um, yeah, man, I don't know this adult life that I'm about to be living. I really hope I'm, I'm, I hope I'm ready for it. I hope I'm prepared. I'm trying to prepare myself as best as I can to, you know, be ready for what this journey is about to become. It's not just going to be YouTube anymore. I'm going to have to start paying rent. Paying light bills, gas bills, bro. I'm really, I'm really, I'm really a grown up. And today is my birthday, which is crazy. I'm 19 years old, man. Moving out of my parents' crib, getting a new crib with my girlfriend, moving from a one state to another state. It's a lot going on, man. But it's the journey that I'm willing to take to be with T and to entertain y'all. So. It is what it is, man. Um, I need y'all to give me a like. And please subscribe to the channel, man. We're going to have plenty, 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 plenty bangers on the way when we move into our house. Bangers dropping almost every day. I guarantee it, man. I can't wait. I'm excited. Man, stay motivated. Stay safe. I love y'all. I'm going to catch y'all in the next one. Because today is, is a very special day. It is my last day home. This is going to be a little short mini vlog or something. Um, but today is my last day in this house, living in this house, living in the dorms, living in Michigan, period. So, man, this is going to be... Something, something to remember. Um, I already got my boxes packed. Got stuff in here. Listen, man, stuff in there, stuff in there. Y'all don't know if y'all some if y'all like enjoy buying shoes and sneakers. This is pain. I have to get rid of all of my boxes, all of my shoe boxes, so I can fit them in this stupid box. But it's all good, man. You got to make sacrifices to. To get where you want to be in life, man. That's what, that's what it's all about. Ain't that right, Pep? Ain't that right, Pep? Say hi, Pebbles. <gasps> hi, Pebbles. You gonna miss me? Huh? You gonna miss me? Bro, where are you going, bro? Bro, are you Can't trust these hoes, bro. In all seriousness, um, I'm gonna go stop by my people's house, my family's house. Um, let them know the news. Let them know today's my last day. Say my final, my last final goodbyes or whatever. And call it a day, man. You know, I feel like my sister is gonna be hit hardest because that's my dog. It's really the only sibling that I talk to on a daily basis. You know, my other brother. Um, is, is locked up currently, he's in prison. So, you know, I can only talk to him through the phone, but right now my older sister is the only sister that I talk to on a daily basis and have intimate conversations with about, not intimate, intimate? I don't want to sound weird, but like deep conversations with her or whatever. And you know, she gets sad when I talk about these things about me moving to Cali or whatever, but 
she understands it and she's happy for me but um i'm gonna go over there today my mama might be there if y'all don't know me and my mama don't have the strongest of the relationship but you know i want to tell her goodbye give her a hug one last time you know because at the end of the day she's still my mom and it's family of everything so you got to squash all all negative energy that you have with your family members man and leave off a positive note so i'm gonna go over there see my family say my little goodbyes and um you know my plane leaves tomorrow at 12 30. so i'll be gone and ready to start my next journey yeah all right got the three boxes in the car now on my way to the packaging company and after that Ain't no turning back, man. Gonna be all set and done. And that's just what it is, man. I'm excited. I'm really excited. For what's to come. All right, y'all, I did everything I was supposed to do. I got my clothes shipped, bro. That shop, it came up to $600, bro. It just hurt my pockets. What you gotta do, what you gotta do? At the end of the day, um, I'm at my sister's house now. My mama, my and my little sister is in there, so I'm gonna get, I'm gonna um, get that reaction of me. I'm gonna tell them that I'm leaving or whatever, and that's gonna be the end of the video, man. <sighs> I haven't seen my mom in so long, bro. This is gonna be weird. What up, though? Hey. What? Good? How are you? Yep. Oh, my buff. Right, bitch. Where's she at? Bitch, press the stool. Sorry, man. That's right here. See, see. Hey. <laughs> Probably. I didn't record it. Huh? No. It's not even on. It's all late. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> right. She's all so excited to see Aries. You told her? Yeah, hmm? now she uh, She was ready to come. She was yeah, so running down the hallway. You're supposed to cry, bro. Why you ain't crying? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> hmm? You know what's that? Right. You know, you, you know you ain't never gonna see me again, right? Yes, crazy. Huh? Gonna make her cry, but she, she probably don't even know he's about to be gone. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. I don't, I don't think she understands the, the, yeah. the whole thing. I'll be back. Wow, it's so it's so weird because I don't think my little sister understands that I'm moving. And that she won't ever, she won't really see me again, for real. Hold on, let me come out here and talk to her. Come here, Siana. Y'all still didn't eat this apple pie? Mm -hmm. Come here. Come here. Come here. Huh. Talk to you real quick, young blood. How you been? Good. Good. So, you know, I'm, I'm moving to California, right? You know, that's really far. Like two thousand miles away, so you probably, probably won't see me for a long time. A really long time. Are you cool with that? You're not cool with that. You want me to stay forever? But what if I move and I, I just come see you every now and then? No? You gonna miss me? <laughs> I'm gonna miss you too! <laughs> Why are you laughing? Oh, that's so... I'm gonna cry.